Our goal is for optimal health, all right? And I wanna show you the health continuum. Where we start is optimal health. Where we end in life, at one point or another, is death. Now, optimal health is our goal for you, or life expression, the same thing. What happens, though, is stress comes into our life. If we remove that stress, we stay towards optimal health, and that's great. That means we're going to be healthy, we're going to fight off sickness and disease. But if stress overwhelms us, we start to go downhill in a dis-ease process. This is where our body isn't functioning as well as it should anymore. All right? You may not feel any of this, but your heart may not be functioning the way that it's supposed to, or your digestive system may be having some problems. Then if we don't catch it then, we continue to go down to asymptomatic pathology. That's a fancy word for symptoms we don't feel. These symptoms are things that are starting to form like high blood pressure, or kidney stones, or cancer. We don't feel those things when they're starting to form in our body. That's called asymptomatic pathology. Now, if we weren't tested or didn't know that was going on, then we keep going downhill to symptomatic pathology. That's what we do feel, our back pain, when the blood pressure is starting to affect us, when our lungs aren't working the way that they should and we're having difficulty breathing, all right? That's your symptomatic pathology, all right? This is the very last thing that happens before cell death, or if it's in our entire spinal cord, death as a whole body. All right, and so our goal is to what we call widen the gap. We wanna take you from death to life, all right, through optimal health to get you healthy and keep you healthy for the rest of your life.